Hey guys, JSQ here and welcome to a mod showcase. This mod is called Auto Switching Tools and um, what it is, is pretty much the, na the, the purpose of this mod is in the title. It auto switches to the best available tool for the block. So I've got my little, uh, my little setup over here. We got a, a variety of three different blocks, which um, a pickaxe, axe and spade will be best at breaking certain items there. So that's the that's the ultimate test of if this mod is going to be cool or not. Um, <laughs> it is pretty cool because I've tried it before and it is very helpful. It's the type of type of mod I like to have playing Minecraft because I always like to order the stuff in my inventory so I know where it is. I know like I have sword in the first slot, pickaxe in the second, and then it'll be axe in the third, and then spade in the fourth, for example. So I always like to know where they are for like the hotkeys on my keyboard. So, um, yeah, this mod kind of like, you don't really need to have um, any structure to your hotbar if you got this mod going. So you can have your pickaxe anyway. I'm not sure if it can be inventory when it's done. We'll possibly test that later. But I'm going to show you the uh, config of this mod as well at the end. But, uh, yeah, without further ado, what this mod does is say, well, I'll just do an example. If I switch to, actually, let's, let's set the time today first and then... Just so it doesn't start raining and going night on us. So, um, yeah, and also if you're wondering what shader pack I'm using, I'm using the Silders one, I believe. Yeah, Silders Vibrant Shaders. Um, oh, I've just closed my Minecraft. I wasn't supposed to do that. I was supposed to get back to the game. Um, anyway, we are back into Minecraft. And that sheep just tried to have a swim. And that black sheep over there is having a very nice swim. But, uh, yeah, we're going to switch to vanilla. Not vanilla. Just normal Minecraft, adventure mode, uh, or normal mode, or is it called survival mode? That's that's the right word. But anyway, um, let's start. Like, should we try and hit it with our hand first? If it switches to a pickaxe, yeah, it does. So you'll always have whatever's in this. You'll always be on this hot bar in the inventory. So I'll always have my hand when I've stopped breaking blocks. But as you can see, that switched to the pickaxe there to break it. God, I almost lost my breath then. Oh dear. <laughs> but anyway, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just go like do a go do a sweep down here and see if it, it does it properly. So yeah, it's switching to the right tools, and as you see the hot bar, it's switching to all these uh, tools. It goes to the pickaxe, axe, and spade, depending what order that block I'm hitting. So yeah, that's pretty cool. It also works with enchantments. So if you have a certain block ID that's say diamond. Um, and you have fortune on your pickaxe to get extra extra diamonds from it or is that look I'm not sure is it I think it's fortune that gives you extra items out of the block but um, yeah and you only want that fortune pickaxe to break a diamond block and not like cobblestone stuff you can set that up um, but yeah this is pretty much the point of the mod it's a nice small mod to show you guys and it's just come out it's a minecraft 1.10 and it's pretty awesome it's probably something I'd always keep on minecraft because it's just helpful really it's more it's more convenient when you're breaking blocks and definitely helpful when you're strip mining. Just in case you um, say that if you're mining to diamonds and stuff and you don't spot them because you're on autopilot doing a uh, strip mining, um, it it would switch to the fortune pickaxe and then get more diamonds out of it rather than just using a normal pickaxe you're using, which could possibly just get one diamond from it. So it's a very helpful mod. Um, I'm going to show you the config. That was pretty much how this mod worked, guys. So. At this point, I'd probably say that if you want to download this yourself, the link to the mod page will be in the description. And on that mod page is the download link to this mod. So, um, yeah, I'm going to show you the config. So, if you go into the mod options and go simple auto switch and config, this is where you set it all up. Like, just before when I was saying, if you remember, um, about using certain blocks on certain pickaxes and stuff like that. So, um it, oh, I think that was set to false when I started. So if you want to set it to on or off, I don't know what back switching is. I think back switching might be moving back on the hot bar to get it, or going back to what I'm not sure what back switching was. But if you use J, it will switch switch, uh, switch back switching off or on. If you use N, it toggles between activated and deactivated for simple auto switch, which is basically the whole mod. So pretty much want to use those i'm not sure if it'd be set up differently for you guys on the controls but 
it is always best to go into options, controls, and all the way to the bottom and find your simple auto switch, see what keys they're set up for. So that is how you uh, start the mod off, basically. But um, if you want it to always be on, you just go back to your mod options, config, and just set them both to true, so they'll always be activated when you come into Minecraft. Um, right, so these, all these numbers and stuff, I'll show you <laughs> what they are. Now, I haven't really read much into order for fortune blocks. Uh, but it's got a description there, but um, let's start with these bottom ones. So, the axe, pickaxe, shears, and shovel, they will, the, this list here is the block numbers that the axe will break. So, say if there's a wooden block, like jungle wood or something, uh, jungle wood will be in here somewhere, the block ID for it. But if you take jungle wood, the jungle blood, uh, jungle blood, jungle wood, block out of this list then it will not mine jungle wood it won't switch to your pick your axe when you mine jungle wood so that's pretty much what it does uh, it's the same with the pickaxe it won't mine any other block that isn't in this list um well it will mine it if you're using a pickaxe but i mean it won't switch to it automatically and this is what i mean about the uh, fortune block ids so if you've got fortune enchantment on your pickaxe, then it will automatically switch to the fortune pickaxe if you're mining any of these block IDs. So I'm assuming some of them are basically, I think these might just be all the valuable items like emerald or diamond. I'm not very familiar with block IDs, so I can't really say what they are. Um, but yeah, it's the same with the silk touch as well. Um, silk touch is when you just get the actual block. So if you mine the diamond block, you'll get the diamond block, not diamonds. Um, so yeah, these... For, order or oh, what <laughs> order for fortune block this is a bit of a tongue twister then it's probably because i'm talking too fast but uh yeah <laughs> this is in which order should the mod take your tools with different enchantments to mine blocks that are stored within fortune for default it will first take the fortune and effie tools then just fortune and then silk with effie what uh I think this might be if there's a combination of enchantments on there. So if you've got efficiency and fortune, then it will it will take them pickaxes. I think these are the types of pickaxes they take. But I'm not quite sure if that's right or not. But it'll be in the mod page, I hope. Um, I think it is anyway. But yeah. Oh, yeah. It resets to default that. That was set to default that auto switch. So it wasn't on when I first. Because I first downloaded this mod and I was like why is this not working and then i was like ah is it enabled and it wasn't so i was like ah press n and it said it activated but uh anyway if you enjoyed this mod guys please leave a like and um if you want to research what those different options are in the config i've just briefly gone over them but the the uh, description will be on the actual mod page which is in the description below if you want to download it yourself so um yeah guys please leave a like if you enjoyed this video or was helpful in any way and dislike if you didn't obviously and uh yeah subscribe for more epic content like this so yeah guys it's been jsq thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video peace